Hey, we're just at the local DG trying to snag some car wash stuff and some tire shine because we're about to be uh, going to meet Hudson, fan of mine that's uh, actually unfortunately at St. Jude right now. Yeah, we're going to be meeting him at Bass Pro Shops in just a bit. And the uh, taco is looking about filthy as all get out. So we got to clean her on up. I think we're going to go with... The bag is secured, and we are heading on back to the crib, folks. But yeah, though, today should be a uh, extra litty day. Y'all just got this new head for the water hose from the one and only Dollar General. And whenever I say that this thing puts in work, look at that. Oh yeah. Things got some digging pressure on it. That's what I'm talking about. All right, we're ready to go, folks. What's going on, guys? Uh, first of all, I'm so sorry for interrupting today's vlog. Uh, but real quick, I just want to let you guys know that I'm opening up the To The Hole, Do The Hole merch again. Both designs are actually going to be open again. So we got the OG 420 design like I'm wearing right now. Um, and then we've got the new, you know, Audi design that I just released recently. You know, a lot of you guys told me that y'all didn't get to get the merch, y'all were too late to get it or couldn't find it. I don't know. A lot of you guys had a lot of different excuses, but y'all wanted me to reopen it, so it is uh, back open again. It's going to be open for five days. So, uh, yeah, if y'all want to get to the whole, the whole merch, uh, it's y'all's last chance to get it. It's going to be in my description down below in the comments. I'm going to have it pinned up at the top. It'll be in my bio on Instagram. And, uh, yeah, be sure to go get the merch and enjoy today's vlog. Thank you, guys. We're now at the uh, one and only Chick-fil-A and... <laughs> one of thousands. This guy's whipping out. We're at Chick-fil-A now, waiting for them to bring out our curbside order. Bailey insisted that we would go to this curbside order and... We've been sitting here long enough to be through the drive-thru like three times now, I think. Okay. But it's okay though, it's okay. I had to add my card. She unfortunately had to add her card on there. Um, I had a different card on there. Who knew? How was I supposed to know? Yeah, luckily uh, Hudson said that his appointment at St. Jude got like moved back, so he says he's gonna be getting out of there like around 10.30 to 11. Chick fil A's asking me for an experience picking up my order today. Feedback. I haven't received my order yet though, so. Gotta give him that one star. But yeah, though, everything should be going smooth with uh, me that with Hudson at Bass Pro. Oh, 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 oh. Is it about to go down right now? Mm, that nice. Not very promising. Oh! Then you got a coffee. Not if not. this compass gets her damn order before us, she's got a coffee. Hi, how are you doing today? Pretty good. How about you, man? Doing pretty good. Are you Bailey? Yeah. <laughs> no, that's from him. <laughs> he got jokes. So no, you're okay. Thanks so much. Thank you. I'll show them what we got first. I didn't get the spicy this time. Yeah. Dude, do they have any hash around this thing? Yeah, they're under it. I think they put them under it. I don't see any hash browns. Dude, Chick Fil A didn't give me any diggum hash browns. They didn't man. give me any either. Gosh, oh my! We gotta call them. I need hash browns in there. Chick Fil A? That is just unheard of. And my bowl was not even that diggum hot, dude. Could a uh, Chick Fil A on the Safari or Google Maps or Apple Maps or something? Oh, oh. Excuse me. I'm sorry. Thank the Lord, right? Oh my gosh. Who's that I'm happened? sorry. That's okay. Um, so we both got regular bowls. They're supposed to have hash browns in them, but neither of them have hash browns in them. So we're currently out of hash browns. Um, so were they replaced with fries? Yeah, fries. No, they didn't give us fries, but fries would have been straight. Okay, I can give you some fries. Yeah, there, thank right? you. So sorry. They're supposed to be replaced with fries. They just shouldn't get them in them. What in the hell? They ran out of hash browns. All right, let me get some ketchup. I'm about to just. Full yeah, about just full ten on her. Right? When in doubt, folks, you already know that's the move. All right. Manager over here at Chick Fil A is super nice. She just brought out these fat fries for us. Before she brought them out, she came out here and like you know figured everything out and you know apologized and everything. So yeah, huge shout out to the manager over here at Chick Fil A. And uh, Hudson just texted me that uh, fixed me going to my last appointment. Should be there maybe eleven fifteen or so ish. So perfect. <laughs>
Hudson's been texting me. He said that uh, he's gonna be on the way. And yeah, you also asked me if I want to go up to the top, and I was like, well, yeah. Heck yeah, dude. So, hey guys, we're gonna be all the way up there at the top. That'll be pretty damn awesome. I've been up there once. I'm pretty sure just like once. And Bailey has not been up there. Taco's shining. I'm so happy I got her cleaned. She's been uh, dirty for a little, Always the little minute. Shining, never me shining. Oh my gosh. Bailey's looking great, as always. I'll meet you at front door. Okay, okay, okay. That works. That's what I was thinking. I was like, I do not think that he's in that car in there. But this place is so massive. And leave it to the south to uh, <laughs> make it a bass pro shop. It worked though. I think it's cool. They, uh, they definitely pulled it off. Come on. Uh, yeah, you do the right thing. How are your Good. We have to actually come back Thursday. Really? We thought we were going to have nine or ten days at home. Yeah. But now it's going to be this Thursday. Dang. Mm -hmm. Where are you guys at? Kentucky. Oh, okay, okay. So what? So is this your guys' first time here? You guys come here all the time? He loves it. Really? Yeah, he gets free tickets to go to the top. Oh. All the time. Because he has a St. Jude bracelet, so he just, he likes to go up there. Really? I've only been up there once. I actually hadn't even been up there yet. Yeah, I've never oh, been up to the top. Go. He can get you a ticket. Oh, that's awesome. Twenty eight design stage on a 420. Yeah. Dude, that's like the perfect setup for Ollie. I can't wait to put the 20 and a half inch assassinators on my 420. They telling me there's going to be gear reduction and they were going to ride like crap. Yeah, I mean, they ride pretty, you want to go check out the fish tank? They ride really smooth, but it, it probably would need a gear reduction because they're so heavy, you know. But, yeah, this place is crazy. I like looking up top. It's so crazy looking up there. It's a long way up. I know, right? So, you do like bass fishing and everything? What's your PB? Um, probably like a four and a half. Four and a half, five, heck yeah. Four and a half, five is a good size bass, dude. That's, 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 that's a big one. Friend, he caught it. We had an eight pounder in there one year. Yeah. And he caught it like five times the same year. Oh my gosh. Yes. <laughs> it wore that bass out. Yeah, that's my personal best is an eight pounder. Look at that gar up there. Yeah. Like, they should have some crappie in here too, right? I don't even see any of them. What in the heck? We got some giant brim and some huge bass. Where y'all crappie fish at? Uh, I go to the lake on the bubble. Okay, holy crap, okay. <laughs> yeah, man, I had to respond to you. It took a little bit to respond to you because I was trying to figure out if, you know, it'd work out. I just got my truck fixed and everything. Yeah, so I was trying to see if we'd be able to make it, but I'm so glad that we got to come on down, dude. Yeah, you guys have been wanting the Bass Pro Vlog, and uh, I'm glad that Hudson just dropped a comment on the, that recent video and asked me to come out here, because we've been needing to come on out here. I haven't been out here a little bit. This is Dagon hunting things. We're going to the fishing. <laughs> he said he'll shoot anything that moves. That's hilarious. Yeah, I used to uh, deer hunt a good bit, but I got a little impatient with it. I started getting into fishing and riding four-wheelers, you know. <laughs> Yeah, I saw your uh, answer photography too. Yeah. I saw your photography account. That's yeah. awesome, dude. How long you been doing that for? Uh, this may be a second year. I can't remember. What kind of camera you got? It's a Canon. Yeah. I don't know yeah, this is the Canon right here too. This is the EOS M50, but yeah, it's, uh, definitely got some mud spots on it. Yeah, I know, right? She's she's really dirty. It's in mint <laughs> yeah, everybody always wonders like, what happened to your camera? I'm like, I'm a mud YouTuber. I mean. <laughs> I'm trying to get to this frog section. That's like my favorite section, dude. Uh, here they are right here. You like using top water frogs? Yeah. I dude. spent way too much money on fishing. Dude! I've got two. I've still got a bag I've got to get. <laughs> dude, I was so bad about getting lures. Yeah. <laughs> Anytime you got a Bass Pro, they rob you of so much money. They got every frog you can imagine, though, dude. Yeah. I got this spider. I haven't even really tested it out yet, though. I bought uh, a rod down here when I was like staying down here for like months at a time. Yeah. And uh, I caught, I showed the bass I caught. I caught yeah, show me a picture of it, dude. I caught a bass and I caught a one catfish when I had been back. So y'all were staying here for months at a time at one point in time? Well, when I first, I just got diagnosed this year, February 10th. Really? Yeah. Day gone, dude. Yeah, I'm glad you're not having to stay there months at a time anymore. There it is. Heck yeah, dude. That was a nice. Where was that at? Yeah, at uh, catch or uh, Shelby Park Farms. Yeah, I saw it was like a park bench there and everything. And but a blue spinner bait, and I caught it same time. Really? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's my favorite. I would use these mice all the time when I was younger. <laughs> you caught a beaver? I killed it. Oh, uh, you killed a beaver? <laughs> That's crazy. That's a huge beaver, dude. I think it was pregnant. Holy crap! 
That's that one I call six pounder on that white mouth. She get thrown around on the pool or that much? Uh, she hangs on pretty well to be honest. I, In the videos, it looks like you're uh, abusing her. <laughs> yeah, I try. I try and like you know limit the sins a little bit, like you know tone them down a little bit when she's on the back. But yeah, she she gets thrown around a good bit. I can't wait to eventually. I want to get her that Renegade XMR five seventy. Oh yeah. That'd probably be the best four wheeler. Uh -huh. So you like the four twenty more or the Outlander? Outlanders are more fun. My friend's got one. It's a 570 though. Yeah. He just bought it a few weeks ago, but he lets us ride it sometimes. He yeah. Them. They're fun to like. They're fun to ride for sure. But they're all. Exactly. You can't. You can't really break them. And then when, if they do break, it's nowhere near as expensive to fix it either. Yeah. See, so yeah, we all got in for free. It's a taste at St. G. That's awesome. <laughs> yeah, they don't buy anything. I think. But one big old Mississippi River blue cat. What do you think, Bailey? That's pretty cool. How oh, long does it take like to edit a video? Oh my gosh, long, long, long. It depends on how lazy I'm being, really. That's the main thing, you know. But about like four to eight hours, probably, something like that. Yeah, and the restaurant up here is crazy, too. The food's amazing. Really? I didn't like the food downstairs. No, it's not really. No, not downstairs, down the. Down a good bit, down a good ways. Yeah, look at their fish tank. That, that's all crappie up in there. Yeah, it's all crappie in there. Let's go look at it. Big black crappie. Yeah, there's some huge black crappie, dude. It's a big blue cat, too. I wish I got the glare. I got some glare in there, but there's a huge blue cat right there. This tank is wild. They got like trees going through it, dude. There's the tip of the pyramid, though. There you go. I like this side a lot more. I like, yeah, I like how you can see all across Memphis. Yep, and you can see that that's the hotel y'all stay in, right? That's what he was telling me. And then it goes all the way out to that golden dome. No way, yep. dude. St. Jude is massive. Like all that right there is St. Jude, basically. Like all those buildings. It takes like 2.8 million dollars to run it each day, or something like yeah, that. It's, it's crazy, and then it's all free, right? It's all. Basically. Yeah, basically. Yeah, I guess we can head on back down that way. Hudson was just telling me about uh, how he's going to be looking for a 420 here soon. Hopefully, he'll be living that 420 life <laughs> here soon. Yeah, I can't get over this place. This place is cool. I really recommend it here. Yeah, it looks like they're whipping up some fire stuff in there. I'm gonna have to go get. We're gonna have to come up here and get us a steak sometime. So, how you like in Tennessee? Sorry, right. nothing like home though. Nothing like Kentucky. He's telling me nothing like home though. I was asking how he likes Tennessee. He, the, every time we have a chance to be home, even if it's for four hours. Really? Home. Yeah, for sure. We're the same exact way. We have a big Sunday dinner. The whole family after church. I can't exactly. get over this. Rocking chairs out there on the balcony. Just enjoy. Came at the right time, I guess. Y'all been to the uh, Memphis Zoo yet? Heck yeah. Yeah, my whole, my mom's side of the family came down. Really? One day, yeah, and we all went. Yeah, me and Bailey love that. Zoo. It's always a good time. Really? Yeah, we Heck yeah. That's convenient. Yeah. Yeah. It really is. Because, like, in the hotel over there, they don't have, like, a kitchen or anything. No, like so you're limited to what you can eat. Yeah, so when I, I was here at first, yeah. we went over to my uncle's, and yeah. my aunt cooked me whatever I wanted. That's awesome, because eating out gets old real quick. Yeah. For sure. Boats. Yeah, for sure, dude. I want to look at the kayaks and stuff, too. I want to give me a kayak soon. You need to break out the wall and buy a boat. <laughs> break out the wall. Oh, one chocolate left. No. You're in luck, dude. Look at these ducks in here. Yeah. yeah there's a bass just chilling right there. 
Yeah. It's so cool seeing how they sit. Man, look at how that bass just sits right there. Yeah. yeah that's, that's if I ever kill one of those, I want to get it mounted. Oh, they're like pretty rare? Yeah. Around where we live. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I haven't been duck hunting yet. But some people, like, where they live, they feel a limit of those. Really? I don't know if those are free No, I'm going to pay for them. Okay. Well, don't forget. I'm gonna keep the package. She said, "I don't see a free sign on." <laughs> That's funny. But yeah, we need to get a kayak soon, Bailey. You ever been paddleboarding? Nope. Yeah, well, I did it once. It was fun. I'm not gonna lie. People say it's hard. Yeah, I saw it. There's this one video on YouTube of this dude frog fishing uh, on a paddleboard, and I was like, "Okay, if he can do it, no. I can do it." Come on now. We, we, we need we need to get this going. Yeah, I actually do watch a lot of YouTube. I don't watch a lot of mud in YouTube because, you know. Yeah, you see that. Uh, yeah, I definitely see enough of that. And I've also pretty much watched all the mud videos on, yeah. <laughs> on YouTube, you know what I mean? I was definitely obsessed with it before I started making videos, you know. But, yeah, my favorite videos were the old Oscar videos back in the day, you know. Yeah, we got all the renegades yeah back in the day dude they were going through some yeah. of the most extreme trails and they were always full sending too and everything. i always like watching them go to the skeg yes yes crazy skeg dude these things right here oh yeah power poles i like this little bass tracker uh classic xl i know a little pond prowler <laughs> these two yeah. this one dude look at this sparkle yeah, that's what I've heard. She was talking about the best days of owning a boat or the uh, day you pick it up and then the day you sell it. <laughs> yeah, I've just fished a couple club tournaments. You ever thought about fishing some bass tournaments? Yeah, but I've never got it. I never yeah. got into it. Yeah. Got any parks in mind I need to go to? Any parks out in Kentucky or anything? Not really a park, but like Carlo, that's where I live. Yeah. There's a uh, area 252. Oh, my friend Castle Law has been there, yeah. West Tennessee Motors? Yeah, Here are their alligators. A little smaller than the ones that they got to see. Yeah. They actually fed alligators in Florida. Really? Yeah, they put it on, it's like fishing basically. You put a piece of meat on a pole. Yeah. Stick it down there and they bite it. I'm gonna have to hopefully get to do that one day. Y'all got a Florida good bit? Yeah. <laughs> That's hilarious. I'm gonna throw it some mud. mud. I'm gonna look behind and see how much to throw it up. <laughs> Me doing water wheelies on my first Heck rock, yeah. So. On the XMR 570. Yeah. That one wasn't good. Oh, yeah. yeah. This side is. It's like. Yeah. Y'all yeah, was asking him about his photography and everything. Uh, Definitely keep on doing that, dude. That's awesome. Yeah, we loved your Instagram account for it. Yeah, I've been needing to do a big like fan meetup ride too. That'd be fun also. But yeah, you'll have to let me know whenever we get the 420 or whatever. We'll have to figure it all out. Dude. How long have you had that there for? This? Yeah. I just uh, I just got this one, but I had one of this one, but I had an infection in it. Really? Yeah, so I had to switch. Dig gum, oh, man. But this just keeps from uh, not help. Like I don't have to get stuck every time. Okay. Oh, okay. So it just keeps us. So they don't have to get stuck every single time. That's good. But you said you won't be long till that one will be out though. Uh, a few more months. Two more months, real. That's not too bad. No. Watching the videos, man. Yep. And uh, I'll keep on sending it. Keep on making the videos, man. All right. That's awesome. <laughs> Thank you. Bye, Heather. Nice, nice meeting you guys. Be careful on your way home. So yeah, awesome. Folks. Hudson was. Uh, I wish he was staying longer. We would take him everywhere. Uh, there, right. I would just hold him in my back. <laughs> Such a good time with Hudson at Bass Pro. He was so much fun to hang out with. Here, back at the Tacoma. See ya, Hudson. <laughs> there he goes. It's like so pretty up there. Huge shout out to Hudson and his mom. So much fun hanging out with them today. Uh, we got to go up to the top. Bailey, you like the top? I love it. Thanks, Hudson. Yeah, and he showed us the uh, other side, showed me the other side of the pyramid. I haven't even been on the other side. I've just been to the main side looking over the, over Memphis or whatever. But awesome time though. Yeah. And uh, now we're about to go smash on some food. Find some food in Memphis. Some good scrubbing. All right, so. <laughs> 
We're going to all those pizza. Oh, jeez. Don't drive off that far. Like hell, mate. We're going to all those pizza pies. And also, like, right down the way. It's just not really down the road, but, like, not too far from all those pizza. There's, like, the best ice cream joint me and Melly have ever eaten at. <laughs> called, like, what is it called? Oh, it's like, like 901. 901. I don't know. It's like 901 Maggie's or 901 Margie's. Margie's, Margie's I think. Margie's, I In 10 minutes, we're not going to be raining at all, but in like five minutes. It's going to die down a little, a good bit. It's just going to be a sprinkling. So. Okay. All right, we're all chilling here for a little bit, and I'll pick the camera back up when we can get out. <laughs> Two hours. Uh, oh, sorry. just one hour. Oh my gosh, this little roof okay. is uh, not set up correctly. This rain's coming in this Where way. Car, Getting rained on, mate. Oh, here you go. Which it's a blue one? one. It's a blue one. Don't touch the green. I should have just paid ten dollars for the two hours. She's locked. Oh yeah, I see it on the that last time. Yeah, so there's an ice cream place right over there. I want to get some of these in Bobo. Look, people are gonna put their dolls. I want to get some of those. That's so funny. They just put their <laughs> dolls all across town. You just stick them everywhere. Ready to cross before we get hit by this train. I was right about two things. What? I mean, it wasn't really that far this time ago. It was better back in the day. The place is definitely. Oh, 229 is when we have to be back. We'll be okay. If they come over here, if they come over there and give me a dig of ticket for being a dig of a minute late. But anyways, Aldo's is great. Bailey loved it. And uh, yeah, we're stuffed now. Look at this little downtown DG. This is wild, dude. It looks really cool, I know. Look how deep that thing is, JP. Oh, that thing goes, it goes on back there, dude. We are at Margie's 901. I'm probably gonna get that dark chocolate. Yeah, I'm just gonna take a scoop of the dark chocolate and a waffle cone. Yeah, on top of the waffle cone. All right, my camera's about to die, but gave me this diggum burnt uh, waffle cone. Look at how dark it is compared to Bailey's. Like, that is not a diggum waffle cone, dude. Whenever I asked him about it, he's like, oh, I don't know, I just grabbed the first one I saw. But, so, I don't know. Yeah, I think it was kind of a news pack. Yeah, but whatever, dude. I mean, by the time, I'm not, I mean, you can't really do anything about it, because, I mean, I'm out through with this one now, so, like, I'm done eating sweet crap. He didn't even, like, offer to fix it, though, or anything. But, yeah, though. Very pretty day out here in uh, Memphis. And uh, yeah, camera's about to die, so I'm about to wrap this thing up. Hope you guys enjoyed this uh, vlog.